you always ask the guests, who were you at 17? But um, I'm going to dive back before 17. I know you and your family have immigrated from uh, Bulgaria, from Eastern Europe. Can you dive into why? Um, who came first? Was it the entire family? Was it your dad first? Why was that decision made at the time? And um, tell us about life before you guys came to South Africa. You were very young from what you can remember. Let's get into that. Yeah, so grew up in uh, Bulgaria, Eastern European country, um, early, earliest um, rather recall that I have. It's very cold. It's snowing. I uh, have to take like two buses to get to school in the winter. So not a very pleasant um, place to be in the winter, especially when you're very small like that. Um, but a nice, nice experience. I had, uh, I had a wonderful time. Um, I, was, I was fortunate enough to, uh, to be able to herd sheep with my, with my grandfather, with my uncle. So in the mountains, looking after sheep as a shepherd and, um, you know, financially, not um, not a great place, but at the time I'm young, I'm having fun. You know, you don't realize, um, you know, what's going on around in terms of um, ability and finance. And, and you know, money is not a is not a thing that's important to you. Climbing the mountains and you're playing with uh, sticks and throwing rocks, and you know, you're having a duel. Um, where I realized, uh, you know, financially, uh, you know, we're not doing so well is I went to school in the city and uh, you know the city the city kids lived a little bit differently but ah, it's okay I enjoyed the mountains I enjoyed the village it was a different type of upbringing but um, yeah lots of fun I, I really really uh, keep that memory very fond and uh, you know good good values and principles from uncles and and from grandmother grandfathers uh, on both sides both mom and dad and uh, dad left the country, he said, you know, I'm going to look for a better life and better opportunities for my kids and for my family. And uh, yeah, I had a jaw. It was hard without dad, um, you know, father figure for two and a half years. So, but I had plenty of cousins, uncles, you know, like, like uh, I love that movie, My Big Fat Greek Wedding, because we've got family for days. It's just cousins and uncles, first, second, third. So, you know, there was enough help. There was enough um, good support. Um, around us if you enjoyed this content and you would like to see more please visit our mitmac masterclass channel on youtube that's where the magic happens bye bye